hello again Devil Talk 73 here what I'm gonna try to see if I can help you do today is some of the lower level fishermen uh, if you can level up on Rocky Lake in Colorado it's a level 5 lake once you get there uh, I'm gonna try to teach you where and when to farm uh, fish there and hopefully Make a little money, XP, so that you can level up. Okay, this is the rig we're going to use. It's going to be a Omni Float 11 feet 5 inches. 11, yeah, 11 feet. <laughs> Inspiracast 3000. See, we got 6.4 pound max there, 6.5 there, 3 to 6.5. And we got 07 mono line which is three pound. We got a chubby bobber, a number four hook, not four, a number four, and flies. All of this can, that you can get, double check and make sure, uh, baits, insect and worm baits, Flies are level five, and we can buy them here if, if you run short. Okay, bobbers. We're using a chubby, which is a level three, so you can use that. And uh, hooks. We're using number fours, which is a level three as well. Okay, so all of those you can buy here if you need to. So that's where we're at. We're in Rocky Lake, Colorado. Uh, I hadn't figured out any sp specific weather. You catch them just about any time. We're going to land here, or spawn in, however you want to say it, at uh, Fantastic Fishing, which is this over here on the right. We're going to go fishing. When you spawn in, we go down this trail to the right. Get that big old tree. Come around. And come right down here. To the right. Okay? Excuse me. Okay, my son was texting me. Okay, you see this fish action out in here? Where we're going to fish is right in here. Oop, forgot to. Important part of this whole mess. Leader length. Leader length is 41 inches, okay? And that should do us good, okay? So let's see what happens. Wrong button. Right in here. There we go. Now you're going to catch a little bit of everything here. You're going to catch cutthroat trout, golden trout. If I remember right, 75. It's about. Oops. What did I do? Did I jerk a fish? Must have jerked it up on that rock. Anyhow, uh, I'll call it brim, cutthroat trout, rainbow trout, a little bit of everything right there between those two rocks, about 75 feet out. So let's see what happens. And it doesn't take long. I fished here yesterday just trying to find a good spot for y'all. And uh, whoa! Reduce that drag. I got too much pole for the line. That was close. Look, one. See, 
young cutthroat. Okay. Now, you can fish here all day, all night long. Just keep on cranking them in. That's what farming is about. Just keep cranking them in. I fished uh, five hours game time and had a little over uh, like forty-three hundred dollars. Now it costs thirty-five hundred to come here and buy the gear with your license and the travel time. So if you fish five hours here, that's not even a whole day. That's just five hours but if you fish here a whole day you should have seven or eight thousand dollars worth now that doesn't sound a lot or like a lot but you got all that xp too and uh, that's what we're trying to do we're trying to level up once here's a nice see xp decent amount of money you're not going to get rich. But this whole game is learning learning to crawl before you walk. Learning to walk before you run. And it takes what I call the three P's. Practice, patience, and persistence. And that's what farming is all about. Those three things. And don't get discouraged. Just keep on cranking, keep on cranking. Just make sure that when you come, you have plenty of bait. Because the bait here is more expensive than if you buy it at the home before you travel here. We're saving dollars. If you save a dollar, it's just like old Ben Franklin said, a penny saved is a penny earned. So if you save dollars, you're earning dollars. One just as good as the other. But like I said, you're not going to get rich in a hurry here. But you're going to catch fish. I don't know what's going on with that bobber not laying like it's supposed to, but I'll just keep watching it. And if it doesn't, I'll reel it in just a little bit. But if you like my video, please subscribe. I'd appreciate that. And hit that bell over there on the right. Let you know that whenever I put up any new videos, uh, you'll be notified. And what I plan to do is go by the lakes in succession. From here, uh, see what I got here. I've got all the lakes by uh, level. And when we leave here, we're going to go to New York. And I'll figure out where to farm New York. Probably for walleyes. Uh, that's a good far farming fish in New York. And I'm just going to go from lake to lake to lake as we can level up. And uh, that way you don't have to buy DLCs. You don't have to buy pond passes. Uh, you can just keep on fishing. I don't have premium. But I just... You know, I just keep on fishing. Catching fish, catching fish. That's what it's all about. Actually, what it's all about is having fun. If you're not having fun, find you another game. That, believe me, that's the gospel. Because it becomes a drudgery, or if it's not any fun anymore, it's no use in wasting your time. If you're out just to prove a point, you're not going to have any fun. <laughs> One of my friends Now, here's the other thing If I don't get it Oh, there we go If I don't get a strike, see it's drifting back towards us a little bit. So if I don't, let me show you something, another place. 
Now, they're not going to buy as fast as where we were, but right over here against this wall, I'm off of it just a little bit. That flat face of that rock wall. See, we're still not vertical. Here we go. Now we got a vertical bobber. That means that bait's down there where I want it. You're not going to catch them as fast over there, but maybe by alternating those spots. Catch one, go the other. Catch one, go the other. So now let's go back here. to throw that one in its mouth but you can fish from here all day long all night long and uh, like I said I haven't known any difference in the weather to make a difference in what you catch or how many you catch uh, that makes a difference <laughs> I think 3 to about 9 is where, uh, 103 to 109 is about where we need to be over there against that, that flat surface. That's where the golden trout are. Colorado golden trout. Oh, got something a little bigger now. This one I wish I had more line. But, if you're level 6, you can get 4 pound or 5 pound line when you come here before you come here but I I'm trying to do it just like as if you've got level five and you just arrived and the heaviest line you can get at level five is three pounds so that's what I'm using and that's the reason I'm using it that's a decent fish you just have to play it a while there we go two pound cake throw trap okay now we'll come back here Them flies on that little hook takes it a while to get down there. Don't weigh very much. There we go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to fish an hour, in 17 more minutes, and uh, then we'll do factors of so that you can see this is not fruitless. If you can level up here and then move on to New York. Now I tried lures here, but I didn't have as much luck with lures as I did with the flies. Ain't many lures you can buy at level five, but but if you've watched any of my videos, you'll find out if I don't get a strike in four or five game minutes, I reset. can do is we can do this. We can cheat. <laughs> I like to cheat sometimes. Bring just bring it on over there to where we where we want that one. There we go. Now you're getting enticed. Now real fishing, that's what I do when I'm real fishing. If I don't get a bite, I bounce that bait along the bottom. 
Make them want it. Young cutthroat. Okay. Now let's see. Where are we going to have some bait fish top of the water? Let's try it right there. Very nice uni. See a little further over there to the left. And throw a little further out. It's further away. That makes sense, doesn't it? Come on, get down there, fly. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. This will probably be the last fish we catch, and then we'll do a we'll catch one here in the next few minutes and see what kind of a factors we got. And like I say, don't get discouraged. Everybody has to go through the same progression. Unless you got a lot of money, which I don't. And you buy DLCs and you buy pawn passes and and you can do all that stuff. That's But you don't learn anything that way. You learn by going from lake to lake to lake to lake and do that progression. And that's hopefully what I'm trying to teach y'all. Or learn me. <laughs> Teach you or learn me. Okay. That may be a bluegill. I'll catch a bluegill over there. Exactly six o'clock. Exactly one hour. A bluegill. Okay. Let's see what we got here. We have caught ten fish in an hour. That's roughly sixty-five dollars. Sixty-five dollars an hour. Okay, now the XP is uh, a little more to figure. So I wish they had a up here where it told you what the XP was, but it doesn't. Okay, we got 14, 25, 36, 48, 61, 71, 75. 116, <laughs> 159, uh, 159, 207, 207 XPs, that's per hour, okay, that's an hour's fishing, so easy multiplication, multiple at times 5. Multiply it times 10. 10 is $6,000. $600. I'm sorry. But you'll catch bigger fish. You'll catch more of these as the time goes on than these. Uh, late afternoon, late evening, you'll catch more of these. So that's, that's where it is. So I hope I helped you some. Uh, that's my intention. Don't want to hurt anybody. If you see me out in a game, Please feel free to ask me questions. I'll happily answer if I can. Uh, if I don't know the answer, I'll try to find out. Or if you post, if you watch my video and then post a comment, uh, something you need to know or want to know, I'll, I try to answer my comments every day or every other day. And uh, thank you for watching. Here again, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And uh, I appreciate you very much. Thank you again for watching.
good luck, tight lines. God bless you and your family. And uh, I'll catch you out here later. So y'all come back now, you hear?